do 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 Pity Weezer, what's up? How you doing? What's up, guys? Um... First of all, I'd like to apologize because we made, uh, you know, we made the crime and gaming channels. Um, we ha we've had other stuff on our plate that we've been thinking about and doing. Um, and taking care of mental health and stuff like that. Wise guy, what's up? Hi, Stella. Um, this is not in relation to that at all. This is something that I want everybody to know. Because, uh, well, in case something else happens, I want it on record what happened today so that you guys know. The people that we care about, yeah, God bless you too, wise guy. God bless you. Okay. So, me and Shani are in here sitting watching a true crime video. And I, we, get, we hear a knock at the door. So we're like, oh shit, what the hell is this? I knew it couldn't have been police because I looked out the window. There's no cop cars. There's nothing like that. So, okay, thank God for that. But I get to the door and I look out the, the front and through the uh, cloth thing, you know, we have, it's like this, one of these sheer curtain things on the door. And who do I see? None other than G-Man. It was G-Man at her door. Yes, that's correct. He just got on his bike. He came from, he said he came from New Jersey, I guess, um, specifically to come in and show up at this door. Um, I'm going to be honest, immediately when I saw his face, I was like, oh, shit. Yeah, wise guy, it was G-Man. He just showed up here. Um, so I said... I didn't even answer the door at first because I was like, holy shit, what is going to happen here? So Shannon got up immediately and went and answered the door and basically said, what do you want, right? He said that he wanted to talk to me specifically. So they were going back and forth at the door for a little while. And if you want to talk on this at all, you can too, honey. If you oh, want. I told him. That he needs to pull out his pockets. That he needs to show me what's in his backpack. Because I don't know if he has a gun or not. Because he's already threatened Alfred Mims. That's true. That's true. Yeah, Teddy Bear. Yeah, G-Man came over here, dude. He just showed up. He had a bike. Oh, no, man. That's bad news. It was bad news. It was, and, and thank God. Thank God it didn't go anywhere violent. But, uh, I said my few choice words. Yeah. Let's, let's just say that it, 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 it got kind of heated, but there was no violence. Thank God. Nothing like that happened. So G man came down here, I think basically to tell me, he told me that his sister, um, was insisting that isn't G man tech technically trespassing. He will be if he comes back. And that's why I'm making the video. Thank you, wise guy. You're keeping me moving this video fast so that I won't be going 20 minutes because I like to go into detail when I explain things. So thank you. Um, I'm making this video mainly to say to G-Man directly, and he, I know he'll see this, of course, because this is the only place that we're at and the reaction channels will take this and use it. C Carrie's probably on right now. So I want Gary Moore, I want Gary Lamont Moore to know right now, starting now, that if you show up at this residence again, that you were to today, the, the door will not be answered. So it's stupid for you to come anyway. The door will not be answered and the police will be immediately called and they're going to escort you off the premises for trespassing. That's what I want known. You detail as much as you want, Rev, especially Janie. Okay, thank you, Teddy Bear. Sorry, don't rush. I'm just like, uh, 
I don't like him showing up at your door like that. He's been very nasty and mean to you both. Yeah, I know, wise guy. Thank oh, you. Oh, he demanded me to apologize to him over... What was it? What was it that I, I said it was a death sentence if I was in a car? It is. Uh, well, the clothes thing, too. Like, he, he oh, you, you said that I threw your clothes you away. Did. Yeah. Well, I mean, if we want to explain all of this, it's like... It doesn't need to be explained. He did all this stuff. Yeah. Yeah, he did it. It, uh, whatever. It, Put yeah. us in a hotel where we couldn't even drink the water because it had bacteria in it. True. Chose the cheapest hotel he could find. That's true. And and then what happened with that hotel? Well, you are guys already freaking know. Oh, yeah. D Teddy Bear says that he had him on panel and he was hard on us. Yeah, I know that he's been talking shit. I know that. But every time he's in person with, with me, he's like really nice and shit. So that it's manipulation because the guy is a narcissist. He's uh, and mentally ill. He's extremely mentally ill. Restraining order, I agree, Teddy. Yeah. We might, if, 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 it, if he came back, if this becomes a problem where he shows up here more, that's going to have to happen. Absolutely. We'll have to file a restraining order. I got to go to Scranton for that, and it's a pain in the ass. You got to go to the goddamn courthouse and all that bullshit. Do I want to be involved with that? No, I don't. No, so, I don't so, either. I want him to know that he needs to leave us alone. Yeah, and the cops will be informed that he's not wanted here, and that's really enough. Because, yeah, he's completely two-faced, Teddy Bear. He is. Guy, I, I, know, I know how these internet, like, I don't want to say just internet people in general, but I know his type of people, which is their, the fixation crazy people that it's, you can't deal with that. No, you, he was trying to blackmail Jason into doing things for him. What do you mean? Like saying, I got money for you, but yeah. you got to do these things first. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, he was basically saying, it was really weird. He was basically saying his his sister was requiring him to do this with me because I gave him the house, okay? That's ridiculous to start with. He's his own person. And I've told him, you don't have any debt from me, dude. I gave you that house freely and it meant freely. You don't need to give me any money at all. Um, I've told him this right off the bat. Yeah, it is strange, isn't it, wise guy? But this is his pattern. This is the same thing he would do. He'd bring us stuff when we were staying at his place. He would bring us stuff and then go, okay, I brought you this. What can you give me? So it's that's not giving people things. That's not charity. When you, when you give somebody something and there's strings attached or you need to give them of things of yours to get what they gave you when you didn't even ask for it, he would just bring these bags of of nicotine vapes and and delta eight vapes, tons of them, right? He would just give them give them to us and then and then say eventually, well, I would you know there's about nine hundred dollars worth of product in that in that bag. What could you give me? That's not charity. I'm I'm sorry. The comments, G Man and Carrie both are sending people after you guys. Well, that's what look. The cops are going to get involved with this if you guys have people come here. The cops are going to get involved with you people, okay? Because that's harassment. G-Man's using YouTube for content. He's as bad as reaction channels. I know, wise guy. I know it. Please, oh my God. Please make it known right now that it, uh, I have only bought you two pizzas and never gave you drugs or anything else. Yeah, that's true, that's, Teddy Bear. That's yeah. true. You never gave us anything like that. I you just to. you've given us food. That's it. That's all you've. I don't know why you'd care that we say that. I I I don't get why you would. What What does it matter what you gave us? But I I know people also in chats like to make shit about themselves too. So I'm gonna stop paying attention to the chat and I'm going to wrap this up for you guys. And if there's anything you want to say, honey, you can say it. Oh, he makes me so sick to my stomach. So this is what I'm going to say. Gary Lamont Moore cannot be at this address. And I, I'm not just going to spew my address out there, but he knows and I know and Shani knows what address this is. He is not allowed here.
period. I want this on record. If you come back here, Gary, you will not hear from us. You won't see us. You're going to see a cop. That's what you're going to see. And he's going to say, sir, what are you doing here? I want to talk to the people. They don't want anything to do with you. Period. They don't want anything to do with you. You need to leave. That's what's going to happen. So don't waste your money on a ticket to come here from Jersey. That's oh, so I came. fucking nutty. He's like, oh, I came all the way to Jer from Jersey to see you. Dude. No one asks you to. Exactly. We're the last people that we you want to see, and we don't want to see you either. Okay? So tell your sister that you're released from debt. I don't need nothing. I don't want nothing. Okay? From you. If you come back here and you resist the cops saying leave, you're going to be arrested. And it's not worth it. Because you're going to be, uh, it's trespassing. Is there anything you want to say, honey? Else? Oh, I can't stand him. He, he, I. He, do he this just, for you. he's just very threatening in a lot of ways, how his demeanor is when you see him in person. Very threatening. Um, <clears throat> and me, of course. When I feel threatened, I, I, I you know, I, I, I become a bull in a china shop. <laughs> and, um, like, I, I want nothing to do with this guy. I want nothing to do with him. Like, he, he thinks he can fix things and he thinks he can demand, like, apologies for something I don't even feel sorry about. No. That's just Ooh, bullshit. Like, I, I don't go every day and attack him. He attacks me every day. Right. Yeah, we ain't taught. We don't. We brought him up maybe three times. Yeah. I you want, I mean? I want like, nothing to do with this, this scrub. There you go. You know? And he wants to say he isn't a scrub, but all the money he got is because of other people. Huh? <laughs> Well, yeah, he was bragging. He's like, I uh, is scrub. I can go right now to the bank and get $25,000. Yeah, because of me, Gary. Because of me, you can go to the bank and get $25,000. Okay? So, you call it a scrub, call it whatever the fuck you want. It's because of someone else that you can go to the bank and get $25,000. So, yeah, you're still a scrub. Sorry. Yeah. And you stole from poor people. You took everything from poor people. And then he has the nerve to my face tell me I'm not a believer in Christ. Oh my God. Yeah, that was ridiculous. And saying we're not married, all that bullshit. Yeah. 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 You, know, you, you wish I wasn't married. I think that's what it is. You wish I wasn't married. Yeah, he does. He does. He, it's so clear to me. You when wish he, I didn't clean on to Jason. You wish that. When he's around you. It's clear that he's the type of guy that gets off on aggression. Yeah. Right? I see that. You see that, right? Yeah. He's he's I mean, he goes mm, like does that thing, the G Man thing. Well, I hope Rosie and her four little or her five little sister have fun tonight. Yeah, Rosie Palms, exactly. You know who that is, guy, Rosie Palms. That's his girlfriend. And that's fine. Okay, there's. I'm not. That's gonna stay his girlfriend because no woman sane, no sane woman would ever want to get with that psycho. <laughs> I look. We've seen enough. I've seen he's, enough. He's man. unstable. He he is, man. I didn't know if he had a gun or not. That's why I told him to like show me what you got. Yeah, empty your pockets. What the hell? <laughs> you know, I don't. I don't trust him at all. Mm -mm. You know. He's already threatened one of the people within the community. Yeah. So actually, he's, he's threatened a lot of people in the community. Yeah. Trans people, gay people, yeah. women. He always goes after women because he's an incel. Uh, uh, he says he dates, but uh, I don't know. No, I can't see a woman ever wanting to be with that <laughs> and his sweaty ass. Oh, my goodness. Anyway... I said what I needed to say. Don't come back here, Gary, because you're getting the cops. That's it. Yeah. Do you want to chat some more? It's up to you. If there's any, it, it'll. I, 
Yeah, I don't see how anyone trusts him. Nah, I don't see that either, wise guy. I don't see that at all. E even though we did, but it was like, I, I don't even know what went through our mind then. Nah, we were, we were a family in need, honey. We were a family in need. And he took advantage of it. Yeah, you could say that. He took yeah. advantage of it. Yeah. Yeah. But he ain't taking advantage of me again. No. And he certainly can't buy me like that. No. I cannot be bought or sold. I am my own person. Yeah, that's what he's looking after here. And I still think he's he's thinking that something could come with you too. I really think that. He is so scary he can trick or treat over the phone. Thank you, Shannon and Rev. You're welcome, Teddy. Sure. I mean, shoot. Yeah, I just want it known by everybody that we know on the internet. And pretty much you guys, like, you're, you're, you're it. You get what I'm saying? You're the only ones that, that we talk to is on this platform. So I just want it known that he's not welcome here. No. And if he comes back, he's getting pops. That's it. He used you guys to the fullest extent and he knew what he was doing. Yeah, exactly. He ain't innocent in this and he never will be innocent in this. No. He can go talk to God about how he treated two people who gave him everything. Yeah. Now he wants to blackmail us some more for money. I ain't going to be blackmailed for money. <sighs> Take your money and shove it up your ass. Yeah, he wants, he's using this now as like um, a means of control. A content. It's That's yeah. what it is. It's he, If he can get close to us, his content is going to, he's going to get numbers. Yeah. That's, that's all he is. cares about is content. Yeah. I really believe That's that. That's usually what he used to talk to all the time is just freaking content. And community stuff. Yeah. Dumb. And I, I just, I want nothing to do with this dude. Nothing. Like, he's threatening, man. Yeah, his his way is very weird. It's, 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 it's an unstable person. Like, you, when you come up to somebody's door like this, you don't just start yapping the way he yaps, the way he did start throwing shit out that he knows is bullshit, too. Like, you, I, the first thing you say to me is demand an apology? Fuck you. It's ridiculous. You don't come to me. It Come to where I'm living in my residence and tell me I need to apologize. Nah. I ain't gonna apologize because I don't feel bad over anything I said. I I was straight up like, look, I the first thing I said to him was, we don't have anything to talk about, man. We have nothing to discuss. And he's like, oh yeah, we do. We I got papers and stuff, and I'm like, just just to toss them. They're useless. They're the the the, the stuff. That's the thing. he's trying to hold documents now over my head about certain things. It's all in the past. I don't need any of those documents. Just toss them. Get rid of them. And that's all he wanted he's to like, do. He's like, oh, it's against the law. He's full of shit. He just wants another reason to get in here and, and be in our life. That's it. There's there's no reason. He can toss anything that, that that's from my past if I give him permission to toss it. Dumb as shit. Teddy Bear says that's what he is doing. He is using you, drag jewels, and now me for content. It's sad. Yeah. He was probably recording it. No, nah, he wasn't recording it. I made sure he wasn't. He was <laughs> to which that would be against the law of you in a two party state. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But he wasn't recording it. No, nah, he wasn't recording nothing. If something shows up on the internet of this encounter, then he was recording it. But, and then yeah. we can do lawful action toward it. Yeah, he showed his phone, though. He wasn't recording it. The, but the point is, is he's trying to utilize money and now documents for some fucking stupid reason. He's trying to use this to get back in our life. 
Mm -hmm. That's as simple as it is. And he's a narcissist that wants to control everything. That's what's going on. He ain't going to be controlling me. He ain't controlling anything because he, <laughs> if he comes back here, he's getting cops. That's it. And I'll even say to the cops, I don't know if this guy's dangerous. So they'll, they'll, they'll have three squad cars with the, escorting him away. That's what you're going to get if you come back here. And that's all there is to it. I want nothing to do with this fool. No. Nothing. He was he, even in that even in that brief conversation. He was he was trying to pit us against each other. I know that. I know that's what he always did through text. Yeah, so and we end up fighting, and then not anymore. That no, nah, not anymore. That doesn't work anymore. No. Because <laughs> we literally spend every waking minute together, and we know what each other's doing. Yeah, which is nothing really. Yeah, exactly. So, man, I got to go talk to my therapist over this stuff, man. Yeah, she is. just gave me, like, you, you're doing so good mentally that I think we should push our talks to a month yeah. instead of bi-weekly. Right. You know, first it was weekly, then it went bi-weekly, then it, you know, it now going monthly. That's great. But you know what? I'm not going to let this bother me. No. Because he's just a punk. Yeah. It turned out okay. He's just gone. He just left. Everything is manipulation tool for him. You stand up and protect your flock, Shanny. And I did, man. I protected my man. I didn't want anything to happen to my husband. I love him. Yeah, I love you too. But you don't. That's not. You don't need to stand up and protect me. I yeah, protect exactly, me. wise guy. G-Man has it all, but he is still such a miserable human. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. I'm not miserable. I'm happy with my life right now. I'm doing good mentally. Yeah. Like, my therapist could go ahead and be like, if we ever had to go to court, my therapist could go and be like, she's doing very well mentally. I'll speak for myself, though. If somebody would like to drop us some money for, for me, I'm saying for me, okay? This has nothing to do with Shani. She doesn't do this and it, it doesn't ask for stuff. If you could drop me 27 bucks for some fucking Delta, I could really use that at this point because I'm stressed out real bad at this point. Yeah. I'm really, That's really stressed. That's nutty going from Jersey to here, going on a bus to see us. Yeah. He's like, but you're not responding to my emails and you're not responding to me online. Want... Why do you fucking think, idiot? <laughs> exactly. We want nothing to do with you. That's why we're not responding. It's pretty simple. You both protect each other and keep looking forward. That's all you got to do. Yeah, thank you, Teddy. Yeah. And that's what we're going to do is yeah. protect, protect each other. Yeah. We love each other. Exactly. That's right. We want to be together, too. We're freaking old. Yeah, we're gone. <laughs> that's right you know that's right that's right and, and it, it says in the bible not to let any man get in between a marriage what's he doing uh, yeah, what's he, he trying to yeah do? he goes ahead and tries to call me a fake christian because i get angry at him because he showed up in my porch unannounced right right mm-hmm yep well, we have said so many times we want nothing to do with him. Want nothing to do with you. And then you show up at my porch like a freaking nut nutcase. That's literally the last thing I said to him. I the last time I had contact with him. Go with God. We're done. That's it. I don't want anything to do with you, man. G man projects about people being stalkers while being one. Yeah. That's true. That's true. His excuse was he had to meet the people he sold the house to, but the real reason was to come harass you guys. N yeah, exactly. He had to meet the... No. No. No, that's ridiculous. The, 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 the sale of that place was done. When, when, I tr when, the trans when the deed got transferred by my lawyer from my name to his name, that's it. There's no requirement of any contact. He's full of shit. Okay. That's completely a lie. 
there is no need for us to meet ever. And that's why I said to him, I said, the last time I talked to him, I said, go with God. That's it. We're done. And now whatever he has of a conscience is getting to him. And he's like, well, maybe I should give these people money. Oh, yeah. Man. How about this? You give us the money and leave and never have anything to do with us again. Now there's conditions. There's conditions, though. Yeah. That's the thing. Yeah. He always puts conditions on things to control. I said to him, I said to him, Gary, give me like 40 bucks, right? And we're even. He's like, no, 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 no. There's, uh, there's, there's, there's things you have to do, quote unquote. Uh, really? And then, and then... The dude lies when I said, you told him to break up with me, and then he'll get his money. And then he's like, no, I didn't. Yeah, I'm sure he did that. Yeah, we got the email for that. Mm. That's the thing, too. He lies. When it's convenient for him, he lies. Absolutely. Does. Yeah. He's like, oh, he, he, I, I, you know, liars are liars, and they don't inherit the kingdom of God. Well, you're... You're, you're not going to inherit the kingdom of God, dude. You lie. You do. You lie, dude. That's why, I, that's why I was fine with cutting off communication with him completely forever. Because he's lied about us. I know. That threesome shit and all that ridiculousness. You've lied. Just get out of my life. I'm not going to have a fucking liar in my life. You I'm lied not. and defamed our characters. Why would we want anything to do with your yeah, ass? Exactly. Exactly. And I don't want your fucking money. Yeah, I want nothing to do. The, the dude was saying he was going to buy us an RV. Yeah. I don't want your, I don't want an RV. How do I know he doesn't have cameras in it? Or yeah. he didn't jerry-rig it for it to blow up? Or who knows? Or who knows yeah. With this guy. I've heard his threats toward Alfred Mims. Yeah. He literally was going to kill him and his whole family. That's, that's from him. We heard this directly from him. I have a plan. To, to, That's why I, let, I had him empty out his pockets. Mm -hmm. And then he's saying, oh, uh, let's go down the corner and have uh, um, me and him, just me and him, go have a meal together. Yeah, right. Are you kidding me? I don't know what's in your backpack. I don't know what's in your mind to do. Has he been texting you before he came over? No, we have him blocked on everything. Yeah. You think that would tell him that we want nothing to do with him if we're having him blocked on everything? Well, his excuse for that is is it's like you manipulating and you're just blocking him on it. No, I feel the same. I don't want any contact with him whatsoever. None. So he he's always has a way to manipulate shit. Yeah, he does. He Being does, and I, I don't. I don't want to deal with that. No. I, I I don't want to deal with that. I just I got off social media. I'm feeling a lot better about my life. Good. You know, and who I am as a person. Yeah. You know, I'm working shit out with my therapist. Mm -hmm. I'm doing me, minding my own. And he has to show up at my door when I'm I'm in a good mood. Yeah, that's the devil, man. Yeah. You you're you're in a, you're coming along with your mental health, and that happens. That's the devil. There's no doubt. Right. Yeah. He comes to nip at your freaking ankles. That's right. And I I ain't doing it anymore. Good. I don't, either, I don't need to be stressed out like this like I was. Mm -mm. No. Hell I'm no. fine doing me and, and taking care of my own. I don't know that number. I don't care who that number is. Bye-bye. Yeah. Bye-bye. No. To show up unannounced or not invited is just crazy. He knew he wasn't welcome, but he just wanted to cause drama. Yeah, he did. And he did. But I, I And I wouldn't have even done a video, but I'm doing this video for the benefit of if something weird goes down, I want it known right now that he's not welcome here. And he's he, he wasn't welcome here in this visit, but I'm, I want it known from now on publicly that he is never wanted at this residence again for every, and, and cops will, will get this video. It's mainly for law enforcement to show that I do not want him here. 
and, it's my uncle's house and he's not welcome. And period. you know what? The cops in our area watches us. Mm -hmm. They're they fans of us. <laughs> yeah, well, they know that we're okay, but, but... Shout out to Petville PD. Yeah, they're... Well, it's Blakely PD, but Or yeah. Blakely PD, shout out. Yeah, they, they, we're cool. We're all good with that. But, but... Uh, I don't want law enforcement involved with my life. There's no need for it. But if he comes back here, there's going to be a need for it. Yeah, and and you guys got to watch out too, because he might end up at your doorstep too. Because he's he's threatened that before. I'll just show up at their door. Mm -hmm. I know that's nutty as hell. Yeah, he's unstable. He's not a stable guy. It's good you you're doing this video. This is evidence of something does happen. Yeah, if something happens between me and Jason, you know who it is. Yeah, yeah. That's I, I want it I want it very much out there and known to everybody that can hear that the, this guy is not welcome here. And no, that, and he's not mentally stable no, at all. He's not. He was sweating profusely. He looked like he didn't shave yeah. at all. Um, he was he his eyes were all bugged out like he was on drugs or something. Yeah, that's how he gets when he's obsessed with internet shit. Yeah, he and I'm not shave. doing the internet shit. I'm just doing my own thing. Yeah. I'm trying to make money in, in other ways. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Than the internet. Than, than being a social fucking media fucking queen. Yeah. I don't want... I, like... <laughs> that story we just saw, that was so sad. Oh, which one? That BPD girl. Oh, yeah. De Delvin. Girl. Like, I got BPD, man. Yeah. I don't need to be triggered. No. You don't. I don't need to be triggered when I'm doing so well mentally. You know, I'm taking my prescription meds. I'm, I'm going to my therapist. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm not calling out on the therapist. I'm actually going <clears throat> to the therapist when it's scheduled instead of being a, like, I don't want to talk to anyone. You know, I'm doing good mentally and I don't need that. I don't need that. No. When I'm doing so good. That's why I see the devil in this, because of the, it, this type of stuff can sit yeah, you back. Yeah, and, and you're doing better mentally, too. Yeah, a lot. A lot better. Yeah, I just need my medication, and I, I don't have medication right now, which is why I asked for Delta, because I don't have that. I don't have a psychiatrist, because none of the psychiatrists take Medicaid anymore. Joe Biden, can you help with that? No, no, <laughs> our governor needs to work on that and get more psychiatrists to do Medicaid. Yeah, absolutely. Best of luck getting past, getting past the property line is all I can say. You keep doing you guys, and like I said, treat them like the hiccups. <laughs> yeah, right, right. Yeah. Like, ooh. Yeah. He's so creepy. Yeah. You don't just show up at people's doors. But Especially that, when you know they don't like you. Yeah. yeah. He yeah. has this thing in his head where he thinks you and him are cool. No. No. And I'm the one who's controlling Yeah, that's that's them talking together. Well, I've heard other people say that too though. Like like the trolls. It's so fucking dumb. Yes. Yes. I have stated publicly a billion times at this point. I want nothing to do with G-Man anymore. I want nothing to do with them. This is not Shani saying that. It's me. <laughs> right? Yes. It has, if, if, if you weren't involved in the equation, I wouldn't want anything to do with him. Mm-hmm. Because he's lied about us. That's, that's yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. And now he's going to start doing the stalky thing? No. Nah. No, the nah. cops will be involved immediately. The next time you try anything, the cops are going to get involved immediately. Nah. Who knows how long he's been watching us? Yeah. I'm sure. Yeah, Carrie. Fucking all the time. She, I'm sure she's streaming right now. Absolute psycho loser. That all you have to do is wait for us to come on to stream snipe us. You're a fucking child idiot. I mean, I know you're making money too. That's another deal, but it's pathetic. Talk about yourself. Oh, that's right. You can't because you're boring. Fine.
play games. Talk, do the, I know, apparently she does drunk driving videos and stuff. Just do that. And st leave us the fuck alone. We want we want nothing to do with the platform of YouTube. We don't want our videos on YouTube. We don't want our faces on YouTube. Our faces are supposed to be banned from YouTube. So what the fuck is wrong with YouTube that they allow her to restream our shit? That doesn't make any sense. We're persona non grata on YouTube. We're like demons. We're not allowed there. So that's it. Do you are you done? Do you got anything else or are you done? No, I just pray that you can get that twenty seven dollars. Yeah. Because you need it. Yeah, I need it badly. I need it badly. So I'd I'd appreciate it's it. It's been a long time. Yeah. And today it's just like what a piece of shit. Yeah. So that's that guys. Um pray for us and pray for G G G Man, because the guy is obsessed with shit he's obsessed with me yeah she's the one obsessed with you guys yeah i know i know she's obsessed with us and it's pathetic it's stupid all right i'll see you later i might do a stream i don't know i i just i really if you can find it in your heart cash app cash app <laughs> it's asmr gaming i know it honey i got it memorized man. at cash app it's not, it's not, it's not at. It's, Our dollar sign, yeah, the ASMR, the, all uppercase. Yeah, that's right. I'm putting it in. I'm putting it in. If you can help me out, I need 27, but if you can drop 40 on me, that would be even better and I can get some more stuff. But that's the cash app. If you can help us out, God bless you. We love you. Um, I just really, we're done with this shit, right? Yeah, I'm done. We're done. Ugh. God bless. Made Take me care. Sick to my stomach. Yes.